Hey guys, it's KJ48, and welcome back to my Space Engineers Let's Play. This is Season 1, Episode 18, and I'm just, hitting, I'm just sitting here in my control console, and uh, I actually looked into solar panels. Yeah, and apparently solar panels are not really meant to power much. Um, you could pretty much power your doors, maybe a couple of things here and there, but they're not going to be powering stuff like the gravity generators or the refineries or anything like that. So... Um, they're basically used as supplemental power, so you don't use as much um, uranium as you might. Uh, so I am going to go up there and uh, see what I can do with the solar panels, try and get some up. Um, and apparently the reason they're not producing as much power as they can be is because they're not facing exactly facing the sun. And with the way, um, with the way space stations are constructed in this game, um, if your space station is not exactly facing the sun, you're kind of SOL. So I might be uh, out of luck with that. So let's get out of our chair and go upstairs and see what we can see. Now, uh, really quickly before I go upstairs, I will show you a couple things. First of all, I just want it to be known, I'm not in love with these walls. Uh, I don't particularly like them that much. And I probably won't use them again as walls. Maybe for a hallway or something, but I don't know. I really don't like them as walls. I think I will use the regular, uh, 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 the regular um, light armor blocks as walls. I do like them as floors, but not so much as walls. Um, so I just want that to be known. Second of all, there's been an update or two or something. I don't even know. Um, one thing I just want to tell you guys: um, I did switch. I did change my welding times on a lot of my blocks and. When you switch your welding time, uh, you lose out on some of the updates because once there's an update that comes along that has an item that you, uh, a new item, you won't get those until you get rid of your old um, file. Basically, when I had to go through, I had to get rid of my old file and re-download it, uh, the file that tells me what I have as far as, you know, my building components. And then I had to go through and lower the welding times. And I'm gonna have to do that every time I every time there's a big update, which is a little annoying, but that's okay. Um, there's a couple of things I wanna show you here. First of all, we are going to take interior lights today and put them all around the base. Um, you do get lights here, but I don't know, it still feels a little dark in here, so I don't know. Can you put interior lights on? Uh, yeah, you can. You can put interior lights on a lot of things. That's pretty cool. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go around and put some lights around. I want it to be uh, lit up in here a lot more than it is. Um, one other thing, uh, <laughs> I asked you guys, and this is a long time ago, so you have already told me and I've already figured it out. Um, I kept spawning in yellow ships when I died, and I wanted that to stop. And you basically respawn at a medical room, uh, medical bay, uh, once you've built one. So I do have to build one of these. Maybe today, not really sure, we'll see. Uh, what else? Okay. So we now have grinders you can put on ships. Uh, grinders can only go only go on large ships as far as I know and um, I will make a grinding ship at some point Then there's a welding ship now. I'm not quite sure what the deal is with the welding ship But uh, I don't know if I'm gonna mess around with that yet. I gotta do some research on the welding ship, but this stuff is like Way advanced beyond what I know what to do um, So I'll look into that and we will be getting into that in the future uh, welding ship now, I am going to take a Gatling turret and missile turrets and put them on top of my base, and then I'm going to turn on asteroids. Uh, when am I going to do this? I don't know. It could be this video. It could be the next video. I'm not sure, but it's going to be very soon. Then you have these antennas. I think these antennas are just for show. Uh, what else we got here? Okay. So they have new conveyor things. They have a conveyor frame, which I guess is just to hide the tubes or something. I'm not really sure what the conveyor frame is for, but I like what the, I like the way the tubes look, so... I don't know. Let me see what this looks like. It's not available. Oh, it's not available for a station? Hmm. Must just be for a ship. Okay. Anyway, you also have conveyor tubes that can turn, so that's pretty cool. And you have these uh, small conveyors, and I'm guessing that's for uh, your small ships. Maybe you can't put these regular conveyors on the small ships anymore, so not really sure. And an ejector. Yeah, that's definitely for, for a small ship. And the co connector is probably for a big ship. So anyway, let's do uh, first things first. Let's put up some lights. Uh, do we want to make these colored? Mm, I don't know. What kind of color would we make them? Red? I don't think red's a good color. They should probably just keep them white, I guess. They're just regular lights. They're not really signifying anything. So let's put up some lights. Now, I don't know how much these lights are really going to help, so let me make them quickly and see how 
Yeah, yeah, I mean, that, look at how much brighter that is. Yeah, that's really cool. See, I thought these walls that had lights in them would make it really bright, but they really kind of don't. Now, do I want to put these every space or every other space? And do I want to put them sideways? Yeah, let's put them sideways. That looks cool. All right. Um, every other space is fine. Let's break this one out. It's kind of hard to get them. There we go. So, put that one there. Yeah. Every other space. Oh, no, that's not going to work because it's not going to go in the corner. Can you put two of these? I think if I put one here... I think if I put one here, I can't put one here. Right? Yeah. Can't put it in both spaces. Because when you put a light here, it's actually taking up this block. So because you put a light here, just like Minecraft and all those other games, uh, you can't put one there. Um, which is fine. So we'll put them every other. Uh, end above the doors. Why not? I want them all going sideways, though. That's for sure. We can also put them on our items if we choose. Um, but I don't know if that really makes any sense. Yeah, why not? Screw it. Let's put them everywhere. Alright, can't put one here because of this one. So, do I... I yeah, that's not really going to work. So let's take this one off. And that way, um, okay. So let's go ahead out in the hallway and see where we want to put them out here. I think I want to extend this window at some point. but uh, So we'll put all the things on this side. Put all the lights on this side. Sideways. 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 Come on, stop. Stay the way I'm putting you down. Damn. It's annoying. Can we put one there? I wonder if the glass is in the way. I'll bet you the glass is in the way right here. Oh, I could put them on the roof. I could put them on the roof. Yeah, let's put them on the roof. Actually, I didn't even think to put them on the roof. Let's put them all on the roof in here. I'm like, I'm sitting here thinking, how am I going to get up there, man? I haven't played this in a... In a couple days, just been uh, been doing some research, playing other games, doing some other things. So. Every other, every other. Skip one there. That glass is really going to be in the way. Uh, I have a way to fix it, but damn it, I could always put the glass on the outside. Ugh. All right, I think I could put this glass on the outside, so let, let's try this. Basically, what's happening is I put the glass on this block. I think I could put it on the outside block, so let's uh, let's do that now quickly. It shouldn't take too long. So we need a two by one. Okay. And we need to put it on the outside. Which means like that. And yeah, that's it. That's perfect, actually. I just need to get in position. That's it. See how it's on the outside? Oh, that worked out pretty well, actually. I just want to make sure it's, um... It's properly tinted facing out. It looks like it is. Oh, yeah, that's perfect. Now, now this, uh, this glass is on this block. So that means I should be able to put the lights inside. I know Minecraft, when I mentioned Minecraft, Minecraft really doesn't take, like, do that much. But uh, if you played Feed the Beast and stuff like that, it would make sense to you. Let's knock these up. Okay, now we should be able to put one there. And there we go. Beautiful. Skip one. Oh, this is... This is just working out wonderfully. Skip one. Skip one. Let's put it right there. It's okay to skip that. Actually, I should probably put one there. Yeah, let's put one there. And then we'll knock this one out. It's not easy to knock those off. And then we'll put one here. That should look good. One there. One there. One there. 
One there. 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 Okay. Alright, I like that. Oh, by the way, remember how I went to get this uh, spaceship right here? Well, I'm just going to let you guys know, the turrets are now active. If you go to try and capture a spaceship, they will shoot at you. You better have something to, to shoot at their turrets before you uh, go ahead and attack them. So, alright, let's, let's finish putting the lights down here. Then I will pause the video and craft them. Uh, we got this place taken care of. We could probably put some along the top as well. Yeah, let's put some along the top. Or... Right, this level? Nah, let's put it along the top. Yeah, on the black. Yeah, that'll work. Right? There. 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 I don't know, I'm just putting them everywhere. I'm light happy now. It's pretty sweet. Put one there. Nope, I want it sideways. There. Uh, here. These conveyors need to get knocked up. I might redo this whole top side. I've got a new plan for the roof, but um, that's not for that's not till the later on. I got a new plan for the roof that has to do with my ship and dropping ores off and stuff, and this will probably all be redone. By the way, on a little side note, um, if you've noticed, when you go in, a lot of people have been telling me, Cage, you can just double click on an item to take it out of an inventory spot. That only happens if you've actually gone in the proper inventory spot. Like, if I go into this uh, small cargo container, small cargo container 3, and I double click, it'll take these out, and it'll put them back in. But, if I go to a cargo, con a, cargo uh, a different area that's connected so I can take them out, uh, but I can't double click them out. And I can't double click stuff in there. Now this whole setup here is very, you know, organized and you can get to everything from the assembler. But I don't think I'll do it again because I like being able to double click stuff out of my containers. So in future Let's Plays uh, of this game and things I do in the future, I'm probably not going to use this setup again. Just a little heads up. And just in case you're thinking of doing this setup, I probably wouldn't do it again. Okay. One more room. Alright, this is going to need a lot of them. Alright. Why don't they just stay the way I'm putting them? Why does, why does it do that? There. 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 Oh, you know what? These walls right here are getting in the way of the lights. Um, you know what? I really don't feel like moving these walls. So I'll just put a light right there. Yeah, these uh, these these half walls right here are in the way of the lights. That's okay though. I'm, I don't I don't care that much to be honest. I'd like to I'd like to have this look good. Do I have this window? All right, this glass has got to be redone. Oh, not really. I could just put stuff right here. Actually, let's put many of them. Ugh, I really want that glass to be taken out. Eh, whatever. That'll be fine like it is. Alright, so let's put one here and here. Now, these uh, lights are super cheap, which is nice. So, there. That's fine. Okay, I think that's probably good uh, for now. Uh, let's decide where we're going to put the medical bay. I do want to put a medical bay down. And I was thinking about, like right here. I don't know. Let's put it the right way first. Come on, man. Go the right way. There you go. And will it fit? Oh, it'll fit underneath there. Good spot as any, right? Okay. All right, let me craft all this stuff up, and I'll be back when it's done. Okay, and I'm back, and let's take a look around. Got all my lights up. I got the medical bay. It's actually a really nice place for the medical bay. It uh, actually 
fit in there quite snugly. Um, now nobody ever uses the medical bay anymore to get healed because it's just easier to sit in a in a pilot chair. But uh, like I said before, it gives you a place to spawn. I also put two lights on the floor right here uh, to see how they would look, but I don't know. It just looked a little gaudy, and it just it was a little bit much. Uh, now I can change the color of the lights, and I'll show you how to do that right now. But I don't think I'm going to because you can Oh, we got an incomplete light somewhere. Hold on, hold on. Incomplete light. Where could that possibly? Oh, never mind. I did not finish the lights. We still have the ones out here. Well, they're not that many, so let me uh, talk to you while I do this. Uh, now, the thing is, when you, when you sit in that chair and you go to the control panel, you can indeed uh, color the lights, and I'd really like to, but the problem with coloring the lights is... Should I leave that one there? Nah. Now, the problem with coloring the lights is you, you can't tell which lights are which. Like right here, at least there's no way I know how to tell. Maybe maybe you guys can, can help me, you know, figure out a way to tell. But um, I might add some more lights here later, but uh, that's good enough for now. Uh, but the thing is, they're just they're just uh, like light one, two, interior light one, two, three, four, or whatever. And I have no way of telling which lights are what. So I would have to like change colors of lights and like go back and check and see, you know, oh, is that the right one? It's it's honestly it's a big a big headache that I'm not really willing to put up with, to be honest. Um, now next time, what I should do is I should put down the lights in order. So I know which ones need to be updated, like, uh, like colored. Like, if any lights are going to be colored, I put those down first. But that's not really the way I play this game, or a lot of these types of games. Uh, I kind of just, like, go by feel, and I build, and, you know, I, I make adjustments as needed, but I don't usually have a plan. At least, I do, I do usually have, like, a plan, but not, like, an intricate plan. You know what I mean? Like, I'd have to know exactly what light's going to go where and what's going to be colored in order for me to do it that way. And, uh... Yeah, I don't think I'd, I'd want to do that. All right, let's run down this hallway. Lights are looking good. Digging them. Good lights. I might put a couple there. We'll see. And let's see if there are any that are incomplete. All right. We still got number eights incomplete. Uh, 40. 47. So we got one, two... Three incomplete. Let's see if we can find these easily. If I can find these easily, so be it. If not, I'll just pause the video. Um, I don't think there's any in here. No. There's none in here. This place is clean. Let's move to the next area. What about up here? Uh, okay, there's one. I remember this one. Okay. And what about up here? I don't think I put any up there, although maybe I want to at a later date. Alright, don't see anything there. And I don't see anything here. Okay, I'll find those some other time. I'm not going to worry about it right now. Alright, so what is next? Okay, I know what's next. we got to take care of those uh, solar panels. Um, I did mess around with the... Uh, uh, well, I messed around with the amount of time it takes me to make a solar panel, but I did not do anything with how much it takes to grind. But, okay, it's going to grind a lot faster. Okay, it, just the way the uh, the files work. Sometimes, sometimes the grinding and the building of the item is the same time. Sometimes they're not. Sometimes they're separate. But that's okay. It doesn't really matter. Um, Alright, so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to look at the sun. And the sun's coming down right here this is directly towards the sun let me think about this uh, give me one second okay I think the best place for these solar panels would probably be about right here so what I'm gonna do is the little thing out here to about right a little bit more oh uh, we need more steel plates Okay. Now, the thing about solar panels is I like to make things look good, but solar panels are not about looking good. They're about being in a good spot, so I'm not going to be able to worry about that too much. I don't want this to come out too far, so let's just build it right here and see how this works. I don't, I don't know, because the way the angles work on the 
the blocks in this game. You can't really turn something. You can actually use an item called a... I forget what it's called. You might be able to use wheels. There's an actual item that can turn things. Um, I forget what it's called. Let me see. I don't see it here. I think it's like a rotor or something like that. I'm surprised I don't see it. Yeah, here it is. A rotor. Now, this thing can turn things, but as of right now, as far as I know in the game, rotors do not uh, conduct electricity or connect your bases. So, it, it doesn't really help. If I'm wrong about that, please let me know, because that would really be helpful. All right. So, let's, uh, let's go ahead and put this first solar panel down. All right. So, let's turn that like this. No... There we go. Now we just gotta go like this. Come on, game. It's a little tough. Let's go over here and set it up. Might be easier. No, that is definitely not the way we want it. No. 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 Close. Er. Oh, hold on. There we go. That's what we want it. So I believe we put this right here. Why isn't it going on? Why isn't it going on there? Uh, hmm. Maybe it's got to be a little higher. I don't know. Seven. There it goes. Oh, it to be on the edge. Okay. All right. I see what it's doing. But I want it to be on the other side. So, like that. There we go. Can we put it down here? Yes. Okay. Let's go ahead and build this. Now, this thing is going to be extremely susceptible to meteors and the, the thing about meteors is they only come from the sun yet solar panels need to see the sun so that's a little bit of a conundrum there you want to you know hold on i don't have enough room for that you want to like um put the solar panels in the sun so they can you know you get the energy but at the same time that's exactly where the meteors come from so we will have to put multiple gatling guns up there maybe rocket launchers i don't know we're going to put all kinds of crazy crap up there and uh, why am i so heavy Oh, it's 346. I thought it was 3,461. <laughs> okay, never mind. Uh, so what do we need? We need uh, metal plates. Let's take about 400 metal plates. And I don't know what else I need for the other solar panel. I didn't look, so whatever. It's okay. We'll have enough materials to make one solar panel. That's all we really need. Am I getting back the materials I need? Or what do I, what do I need here? Yeah, I just needed more steel plates. Okay, fair enough. Let's go ahead and uh, build this up. Only got a minute left on the video or two, so I'm just gonna, I'm not gonna bother cutting this. I just wanna see how much uh, energy I do get from the solar panel, because uh, if I get enough, that could be really sweet. And uh, yeah, like I said, uh, solar panels are just to uh, help mitigate the amount of uranium you're gonna need. They're not gonna power anything by themselves. Uh, now, what I'm thinking is, and a lot of people have mentioned this as well, is how about batteries? You know, how cool would that be? Give us batteries. You know, let us charge batteries with the solar panels and then we can keep batteries in storage because the big deal about solar panels is I'm afraid if, you know, if you're ever not paying attention, you run out of uranium. Uh, if you can't run a refinery, you can't refine uranium and then you don't get any more uranium and you get no more power and you're, you're screwed. Uh, so... And that's only getting two, three bars, okay? I can live with three bars. You know, without, like, the perfect setup, you're never going to get four bars. So three bars is just fine for me. Um, that works out really well. So let's go ahead and, uh, let's go ahead and break this one down. And we'll place it on the other side. And as long as the other side gets three bars as well, we should be okay. A bunch of my stuff is going to fall on the ground there. That's okay. Let's, uh, let's just place one on the other side. And you just need to take it like this and basically turn it around. Turn it around. Yes. And then we should just be able to place it right there. 
and we dump all our resources into it. And then we go get the rest, and we will have two, two solar panels. Oh my god, I forgot to meet my my laptop. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get this other one made, make sure it's three bars, and if it is, we're good to go. We've put up lights in our place this video, um, and we've got our solar panels going. Um, so I would call this a pretty decent video. i got a lot of ideas for this world. Um, I'm going to make a cargo ship within the next few videos. Uh, I need a ship that I can like put all my stuff in and, and and basically move it around. But I want to have a system. You know what? After I'm done with this, uh, we'll talk about it. Because this is actually very important. And uh, I want to know what you guys think about it. So let's just finish this up. Hurry up, you damn solar panel. I don't has all day. Look at the sun and reflection. Or is that the welding thing? No, it's a welding thing. All right. So, one more. Come on, give me one more. Are you serious? There we go, three. I can live with three. That's a good spot for a solar array. And I can build that up. I can build it down. And what I'll do is I'll put Gatling turrets, like, in the area. I'll put one, like, maybe right here. Maybe two right there. I could put one right here. And then I'll put one to protect the top. And, uh, you know, I'm, I just have to keep the, uh, the Gatling turrets full of, um, full of, uh, ammo. That's the trick. So, really quick, uh, this video is running long, but I do want to I do want to talk about this one thing. I'm going to make a cargo ship. And on the cargo ship, I want there to be a collector and a, and a connector. One, a thing that will take items and a thing that will spit items out. Actually, you know what? A thing that will take items really wouldn't help that much. Hmm. Because without the gravity, it really doesn't help. Um, but up here, what I'm thinking is I'm going to... Uh, I'm going to make this uh, this collector three wide, and then I'm going to put uh, the things that spit it out. The, I guess they're called, um, what are those called? Well, actually, they're different now because the small ship ones are different. They're called ejectors. I want, to put a, I want to put an ejector on one side and an ejector on the other side, and I want to have the collectors wide enough so the ship can just... Uh, float right over uh, maybe three or four of these collectors and then have stuff shoot out both sides If you ever play this game and you play on the uh, easy settings where they set you over the platform they actually start you off with a drill ship and um, The drill ship actually is set up like that. It's a really nice setup But um, yeah, e either way this video is going long. So let me on this one here. All right guys. That's gonna be it for episode Actually, you know what I might have done these solar panels wrong I may have been able to do the solar panels a little different, but that's okay. They're, they're going to work just fine. Anyway, that's going to be the end of episode 18. We'll see you next time for episode 19. Till then, take it easy.